Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Colina Legacy. Now, I had done a previous video on this game and there were some bugs with it and issues. And so I gave it some time and somebody actually commented down in the comments and told me that the game has been updated. So there's been a whole load of changes on the game and I'm pretty excited to jump back in. Uh, one of the developer notes said that um, the previous save files are no longer available. So I'm gonna have to start again from the beginning, but I mean, it's okay because I'm expecting the experience to be different with the changes. I also took off the motion blur and a couple of the effects just to keep the game running smoother um, because I think that's one part that hasn't been optimized, but um, yeah, this should be exciting. Okay. This is spooky. Okay, there we have our first glyph. Man, this is... I'm excited to try this without bugs, because you get more immersed in the game. You just smack that door open. Boom! What's up? I'm here now. Let's get this party started. Okay, the torch. There we go. And the backpack. Okay, we've got our backpack and here we have our batteries and charger. Okay, let's pick up all the notes. Happy birthday, oh, here's the birthday card. The game feels better, which is, which is good. Uh, yeah, her note where she says that she's feeling a little crazy with all these spooky noises in her house. All oh, right, the glyph. Okay, so it reacts to light. I still do not grasp entirely why, but it does. One is able to see through the glyphs once light shines through the amulet. I recognize those glyphs. I've seen them before, although my memory is not to be trusted. These glyphs are glyphs of power used in the past in times where time in times when time was still young to present an aspect of reality we are not capable of understanding another dimension perhaps there's some sort of seal created by a god capable of sealing a god okay a little bit of a tongue twister there and our almighty amulet there we go <laughs> That's different. I don't remember there being a voice. Okay. Finish what I started. Okay. That is also different. Okay, so ladies and gentlemen, it seems like there are quite a few uh, changes that have been made to the game on top of just the mechanics. So, pretty excited for that. Okay, let's keep the flashlight off because batteries are always an issue in horror games. <laughs> okay. The flower painting. Can I open up these? Oh, right. That scared me. Follow the white rabbit. Now, I think I have everything that I need from this room. Um, I just want to make sure that I don't miss any messages. Oh, I've got his strings on me. Okay. You know what? Actually, we have a charger here. So why don't we put down the charger, charge up our batteries, so that we have a full flashlight set to go. I think it should only take maybe like 10 seconds to charge up the batteries, but uh, in that time, let's just enjoy some creepy ass music. <laughs> and they're finished. If only our chargers actually worked that, that well. 
Okay, uh, yes, remove the charger. That was one of the components that the developer said that he added in, was um, being able to pick up your charger and more outlets. So, oh geez, that scared me. Okay, drawers and cabinets might contain useful information. Keep exploring, the Sphinx beckons. Jimmy, what? Jimmy, Jiminy only whispers words of doom. Okay, Jiminy. You sound like a lovely fellow. Okay, let's get let's get in here. Oh. So the glyph is able to unlock the door. That's what that is. Oh. See, I didn't get that in the last one. See, it doesn't work this time. Oh, this is great. Still a little bit of optimization that can be, you know, done with the, um, the performance of the game, but it's much better. Okay. It's locked. I was just going to say that that's always a weird feeling because it, like, pulsates into the headphones. Okay. Oh mighty, who might it be? If not the sun, the sun and the sea? Oh mighty, who might it be? It's the stars who brightly glee. Oh mighty, who might it be? The children run and hide and flee. Oh mighty, who might it be? The moon's son. He came for me. Okay. Great. So, uh, seems like she also wrote a little bit of poetry. Can he crouch? No, doesn't appear to be able to. Uh, are we missing any notes here somewhere? On the wall, perhaps? Is there something under this pillow? No? No, I don't think so. Okay. So, I think what we're gonna have to do is go downstairs and unlock that amulet to be able to open up the, um, the door there. We're pretty set on flash, uh, on flashlights, on uh, batteries, so we're just going to continue on. I'm going to pick up the flower painting up here. I'm not sure what exactly the flower paintings do. Oh, do not forget the last. Okay. I will be sure to not forget the last. Or the first, or anything else that's going to keep... Wait, oh, that scared me. Uh, keep them safe, okay. So we've got here some, some beautiful artwork on the wall. I'm gonna pop in the, no. I was gonna put the battery in the, on the charger, but uh, I'm not going to. Don't forget the last. Okay, a photo and a message. What else do we have here that we can pick up? There's nothing useful here. Okay. Anything in these cabinets, perhaps? The dishes haven't been done in a while. An old TV, I don't think it works. The maniac has been caught. The citizens of Silo can now sleep safely. Monday last, the 12th May. What? The maniac has been caught. Okay. So there was a maniac on the loose. Pretty much what... I remember that. Oh, there's, an, there's another eye there. What is this? Mom? Jeez, that is loud. Okay. That's hard to read. By the roadside? Ch what does that say? Jocast? Jocast? Awaits by the roadside. What does that mean? Who is Jocast? My dear Alex, congratulations on your 16th birthday. A day full of joy. And that, okay. What is that? Here the... This is hard to read. I'm not sure what that says. <laughs> Let me know in the comments if you were able to see what that says. Okay. Oh, hello, friend. 
how are you today? Okay, so I'm pretty sure that I'm gonna have to like attack it with the glyph Because it has the glyph on it, so that means that I can um, Do something Uh oh Things are getting a little bit intense Oh jeez Okay. Oh, I killed it. I did it. Can I pick it up? Or oh, nope, it has disintegrated into the space-time continuum. And in the meantime, I'm going to charge my batteries because that is very important. I have to have missed something. Wait, G-M-M-A. Oh, wait, what if, what if the jewelry box, is it numbers or letters? Because Alex also has four letters. A, L, E, X. Oh, ladies and gentlemen, we have unlocked the mystery. We have the dining room key. So now we can go downstairs and pop that door open. Let's make sure we didn't miss anything on the walls here. Can't believe I didn't think of Alex. Okay. Let's turn off our, our flashlight here. Wait. What is that? Um. I'm gonna be prepared for anything to be on the other side. Well, it was a coming soon message. Okay. Well, that was the demo of the Kalina Legacy game, which is still in development, so that's why there are still performance issues and bugs and all of that. It definitely a lot better than the previous version where it was just like uh, littered with bugs and issues but they are definitely making some good progress on the game and I can see some good potential in it. Thank you for watching, and if you enjoyed, please do subscribe and drop a like, and I will talk to you later. Don't you understand? This is everything I've ever wanted.